Hello YouTube. This is Augustus Larch. Let me speak to you a moment about popular music. Specifically, Katy Perry. What is wrong with humanity? That someone like Katy Perry can push this cookie cutter radio clutter down the throat, down the, uh, into the ears of America. <laughs> California girls were undeniable. Watch me deny you, Katy Perry. What are you, a Gap commercial or something? Telling people how to dress? Well, melt your popsicle. No. Uh, uh, Katy Perry, oh. You've got female parts and a pretty face. I'm supposed to worship you because of it? You mentioned Daisy Duke. I'll tell you what, Catherine Bach is still hotter than you are. Because she's an outdoors lady. She knows how, probably knows how to live off the land. I like southern girls. Especially ones from uh, Appalachia. Appalachia. I like that. <sighs> My girlfriend is from Texas. So, Katy Perry. Maybe do some toning. Some general conditioning, hmm? Possibly? Uh, you look kind of pudgy. You know? So you got hips and boobies. And you do your makeup well. Doesn't make you undeniable. Or melt my pop scroll. I'm here to tell you. I'm not saying that all music is bad. Some of it really is, though. Some of it is just pounded flat payola bullshit. Like Kings of Leon. My God, that voice reminds me of Scott Staff. If there's a anybody who, who, who could have been, uh, his face would have been run over by a, a train or something before he sullied my ears. Whew, I'm going to have some limeade just to cool off a little bit while I'm speaking to you. You know, how you people get cultivated, Ryan Seacrest? I know you got a tremendously huge salary and your lifestyle is beyond my means. Hmm, is that a reward for uh, dumbing down the population of America through the radio waves? Hmm? <sighs> Jessica Simpson wasn't even as high as Daisy Duke. I mean, the original Catherine Bach. I, I wonder, I, I should look her up and see what she's up to right now. Hmm? <sighs> or Cheryl Teagues, you know? Athletic girls, you know? They're hiking up the mountains and stuff like that. Katy Perry, uh, she's wore those pumped heels too long. See, Daisy Duke wore them for road jobs, you know? <laughs> Gaffle somebody on the highway. But you can tell she couldn't wear those when she was driving around in Dixie. She's a regular girl, a farm girl. Well built. Tall, lanky, athletic. I like to see Katy Perry get a hardship of trying to climb stairs or something, you know? Maybe someone will come back to me and say, oh, blah, 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 blah. But these kids have been cultivated. They listen to this auto tune hip hop. Drives me crazy. <sighs> Just because it's played all the time doesn't mean it's good. I've got an eclectic collection. Each one of my CDs, when I try to sell, when I sell them, when I bring them up to the freaking counter at, well, CD store, that doesn't happen anymore. Those are gone and gone. But, I mean, I sold some of my CDs. I got $20 for them. Because some of them were, I bought, I bought them for more than that. Imports. Good stuff. Indie rock, college radio type of stuff. Uh, I play it, and it's just good. I know, I know fellow musicians and stuff. That's some good music you got there. These kids, they've been cultivated, they listen to good music that's objectively good, and they say, I've never heard that before. I don't like it. Can't you play something I'm used to? <sighs> oh my goodness. Success. Now I'm understanding the world a little bit better. How people, you know, I like some music on the radio now. Alicia Keys, I thought she was like a, a Project Monarch Scion at one point. 
uh, like Rihanna and all the rest. Uh, Murder Incorporated. Who is that? Ashante. It was just ugh, auto tune bullshit. Ugh. And then play bands like uh, Elastica Evaporate. I like that script song. That's all right. It's off. I think it's still on the chart somewhere. I mean, there, there's hit and miss songs. I think Macy Gray's charting again. I never minded her. Uh, that new Alicia Keys song about New York. That's all right. See, so it's getting better. Uh, one, it's coming back, but there's still those cookie cutter, radio cutter holdouts that Ryan Seacrest promotes every week. And doesn't he get paid well to do it? Mass mailings out to the freaking radio stations. Here, play playlists, playlists. It's on MTV already. Well, it's not anymore. MTV's been taken over by. It's on satellite radio or something, I guess. But tell you what, Can Daisy Duke, even though she's a, uh, I mean, the original Catherine Bach, even though she's older, I'm pretty certain that uh, she could uh, make Katy Perry seem like nothing in the sack. There's nothing like being an outdoors chick, you know. And Katy Perry's more of like a salon chick. So, this is Augustus Larch. I'm letting you in on uh, the Gap commercials that Katy Perry puts out. California girls. I will deny you. This is Augustus Larch.